Hey, what's going on guys, Reese here, and well, this is me introducing you guys to my new channel, and I figured the best way to do it is to give you guys a little tour of my uh, my little gaming setup in here, and where I'm going to be, where I'm going to be producing my videos for you guys. So, let's do this. Alright, I figured off we'd start off the tour with a little, like, look around at my computer. And the computer's in a Corsair Gaffite 760T, honestly one of my favourite cases at the moment. Has great man uh, cable management space at the back for computer builders. And also looks very clean inside itself because of the cable management. Um, the grommets are really nice, it hides cables really well. Um, the CPU is a Intel Core i7 4790K I believe. And the, the cooler, I can't really remember it. I think it's a Corsair H110 280mm, but I could be wrong. Um, I'll put all the, the specs in the description below in case I do get something wrong. Um, I have four 8 gig uh, Corsair Dominator Platinum modules, uh, so that equals 32 gigs. It's kind of overkill, but it's not really a big deal for me because whatever, you know. Um, the fans are all NZXT green FZ series fans, uh, 140 millimeters, I believe. Yes, 140 millimeters. Um, very quiet fans. I mean, this computer could be a lot quieter if I had picked better fans, but I feel that these look just the nicest, so it doesn't really bother me. Um, the motherboard is a gig. I don't know if you can see it back there, but it's a. Uh, what is it? Uh, sorry, guys. I'm just. I can't really remember, but I'm pretty sure it's a gigabyte. GAZ97X Gaming GT, I think. Uh, again, it's something I can't really remember, but again, I'll put that in the description below. Um, for the graphics cards, I've got two EVGA GDX 780 Ti's. Absolutely amazing. These things are monsters and can run almost any game up to date. So, this computer is pretty overkill, but again, it's not really a big deal for me. You know, like this could future proof me for a couple years. Um, if you can see down there, the power supply, it's a hundred, uh, a 1200 watt power supply, it's an AX 1200i, I think, from Corsair. So, that, that thing could pretty much power up anything, like, again, a power supply that big is not really necessary, but again, why not, you know, it's going to future proof me for quite some time. Um, in terms of storage, I've got one, uh, Western Digital WD Red 4 terabyte hard drive. And if you look in the back, right here we've got, um, whoops, whoop, yeah, there we've got uh, two Intel 730 series 480 gigabytes. They're in RAID zero, so that's my boot drive along with a lot of my games that I play. Um, let's move on to my peripherals. Uh, that is a Razer Ouroboros 2013 edition. I think it's 2013. I can't really remember. I don't even think they have it. They might not even have a 2013 edition. I'm just not sure in general. Um, then we've got the Daki Shine 3 Cherry MX Blues, uh, which has the green backlight on it. You can get this in almost any color MX and any color backlight. Um, Ducky is a very good brand. Um, we've also got the Razer Sabertooth controller. That's for racing games and stuff like that because I don't really need a steering wheel for that sort of stuff. But um, the screen itself. Uh, I don't really remember the model, all I know is it's a BenQ, it's a 27 inch and 144Hz monitor. Absolutely amazing. Here's my um, webcam, it's a Logitech one that I bought, I don't really know if it's that good or not, it's probably pretty good. Um, and my mouse is, uh, my mouse pad, sorry, it's, I can't really remember what it is, uh, Goliathus I think, I'm pretty sure it's a Goliathus ex uh, extended uh, model. Uh, and this is the speed variant, so there's a speed and control variant, this is the speed one, so it allows me to uh, control, uh, move my mouse a lot faster along the mouse, uh, the mouse pad. That there is the charging dock for the mouse itself. Um, I've also got a 2 terabyte external Samsung uh, hard drive, which just houses all my movies and stuff like that, nothing special. Um, these are my Corsair speakers, I can't remember the model, but I'll put them in the description as well. These are the best 2.1 speakers you can probably get up to date, in my opinion. And I've also got my headset, which is honestly one of the best. This is the Audio Technica ATH AG1 Close Back Gaming Headset. These things are honestly the most comfortable headsets I've ever worn, and I mean ever. They are so comfortable. Um, there's my sub for my um, my speakers. We'll move on to my uh, PS4 business. Uh, we'll come over here. The PS4 is down there, as you can see. It's a bit hidden, but it doesn't really matter. There's a lot of cables back there. You don't really want to see it. Um, this is just a 42-inch TV. Nothing special. 
Um, there's my PS4 controllers uh, with the Energizer charging docks. Really recommend getting those if you think you're gonna have two controllers and you want to charge them. I always have them charging, so they never really die. That's my Yu-Gi-Oh uh, deck box. Yes, I do play Yu-Gi-Oh. Get on my shit. <laughs> um, and these are all my PlayStation 4 games. Um, if you guys want to add me on uh, PS4, I'll, give you, I'll put the my ad on the screen right now. It should be right there. Of my, uh, I don't even know what your PSN, I guess. I was gonna call it a game attack, but that's what Xbox calls it. And that's just a bunch of movies. I've got a lot more, but I've uh, I've let people borrow them. And just back here is my couch. This is just where a lot of my friends like to hang out. <clears throat> um, sometimes I just kick back, watch a movie. You know, I sometimes just sit back here and play uh, my PlayStation from here, which you can still sort of see. It still is okay. It's not great. It's not a great view. I prefer to sit on my actual desk chair. But again, there's nothing much to complain about. This is just my uh, little little table to hold all my stuff. It looks all cool and stuff. Um, there's my little mini fridge. Yes, there's some alcoholic beverages there. Ignore them. Don't drink alcohol, kids. Um, and that's pretty much it. There's a bin and some crutches. I've rolled my ankle recently and I had to use them. Uh, my work supplied them. And there's a bin. I reckon everyone needs a bin in their man cave. <laughs> um, there's this little painting that my mum and my mom did, I, it's, I think it's cool. I just, it just looks really trippy and that's why I like it. And there's my, my traumatized number plate, get on that shit. Um, I know a lot of people don't actually understand that that says traumatized. I mean, I can understand why, because it just looks like traumats. If, if I could put an I in between the T and the Z, it would look like traumatized. But anyway, that's just there for display. I don't even use them on my car. And that's pretty much it, guys. Like, this is my computer, like, this whole setup, it's just, I think it's amazing. I'm gonna, I'm eventually gonna get, I'm getting a desk built at the moment, it's gonna be all black and it's gonna reach from where that bin is, all the way over to the end of that wall so I can have my TV and my computer all on the same desk. So the TV doesn't sit a lot lower than it does now. But that's pretty much it guys, I hope you guys enjoy this video. And this is my first upload so I figured this would be the best way to show you how the videos I'm gonna make for you guys is gonna be done. So. Yeah, thanks for watching. Peace out.